Hi everybody, it's Crystal. Welcome to my channel, Bag of Day Crochet, where you'll find anything and everything that has to do with yarn or crochet. So today I'm going to do a video, um, it's a well-requested video, uh, people have been asking me um, about it. I'm going to try to explain to the best of my ability the difference between a, a tapered crochet hook versus an inline crochet hook. But as always, don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you have not already. And if you look below in the description box, you will see a playlist of all my hundreds and hundreds of crochet tutorials free for you to enjoy. I also have lots and lots of yarn content as well. Okay, so why don't we go ahead and begin. Um, <clears throat> these are the main two types of crochet hooks we have. This is a tapered head. This is a tapered crochet hook. This one right here is an inline. And you can see the difference in the heads. So why don't we go ahead and start with the inline and we'll kind of go over it just a little bit. Now, um, a common inline brand of inline hooks is Susan Bates. Now, the reason why it is called an inline hook is because the head is perfectly in line with the shaft here. It does not stick out or anything go in anymore or stick out anymore. It's perfectly in line with this shaft. So if I was to hold a piece of paper or something up to it, it would be completely in line with the shaft of the hook. Let's hold it up closer and look at it. So, and you can see when you look at it that it does go in, the uh, dip of it goes in quite deep and sharp. And when you turn it around to the front, it has a flat portion on front. And you turn it around to the side you can see how deep of a groove that deep and sharp of a groove that goes into so this is the inline that we're talking about now when you look at a tapered hook in comparison now the tapered hook the head on the tapered sticks out farther so it is not in line with the shaft the head actually sticks out a bit farther. You can see that there is an extreme difference in how far and deep the uh, groove goes in. It's not sharp and it's not deep at all. Let's hold it up to the inline. See that? That's a big difference there. The tapered is much, much more shallow and not sharp at all versus the inline, which has a very sharp, deep groove in it. There's no flat portion on the front of the tapered. It's smooth here, or it's round. But the head does stick out farther. It's not in line with the shaft, like, like the inline is. So, uh, pretty much that, you know, the heads are pretty much the major differences in them. Um, a pretty common brand of the, uh, tapered is boy I have a hero here though um, so it people ask like which one's better well all that is kind of depends on you um, everybody likes what they like for different reasons so like say for the inline hook um, now I'm I, you know so some people I've heard tell me that uh, it helps them to create uh, like more consistency in the way they that in the way that they crochet uh and that it keeps their yarn from splitting and things like that um as far as the tapered hook uh some people say that you can crochet faster with the tapered hook versus an inline um and that your wrist won't hurt so much because with an inline sometimes you have to do it's got such a deep groove in it. I don't know. I can't really explain it. You got to do a extra maneuver, I guess. I, you know what? It really depends on the person. I can't say which is better for you. You just have to try them out. If you, you know, you don't know that you don't know the differences. I kind of just told you the basic differences between the heads, why they're called what they're called. Um, and you can, you can just physically see the differences right here. Um, now I, myself, like tapered hooks right here. I cannot use inline. Um, the reason why I cannot use inline is because um, it's too deep of a groove. It splits my yarn and it is more movements in my wrist when I crochet. So therefore, that is a, the reasons why I choose not to use inline. 
I like uh, tapered. I like to shallow. It's shallow. My yarn does not get hung up on it. And I feel like I can crochet uh, faster with a tapered versus an inline. And it does not split my yarn. Now that's only me. Everybody's different. You know what I mean? I know tons and tons of people who love inline hooks and there's not not nothing wrong with that. I'm not saying anything bad about an inline. They're, they are great hooks for people who like them. I know lots of people who like them. The same goes for tapered. I, I have tried every hook there is on the market. Every hook. The only hook that I can use is a straight aluminum tapered hook. I can't have a gripper on it. I can't use an inline. Um, I can't use a plastic hook. I can't use a wood hook. I can't use an ergonomic hook. I have to use a straight aluminum tapered hook. Um, that is how it has to be for me. I cannot use anything else. But that doesn't, it doesn't mean that it has to be that way for you. You, especially if you're new, should try out all the different hooks, you know, within your means to find out which one is most comfortable for you. Um, cause there's so many hooks on the market, especially if you get wrist pain. Um, there's a lot of them that work well for wrist pain, you know, as far as ergonomic and stuff like that. Um, they have ergonomic hooks that are in line and tapered. Um, but if you want to start off with just trying to figure out whether you like the in line or the tapered, uh, give them a go and see which one works best for you. Like I said, um, I'm not saying one's better than the other because it's not, it's only your personal preference. I myself choose the tapered. But there's nothing, you know, there's nothing wrong with the inline either. It's just what you get used to. I used tapered head since I was little. So uh, I used a straight aluminum tapered head hook since I was little. And I will never change because that's what I grew up with. And there's nothing else that I can use. Um, so let me know in the comments which one you, if you, you know, if you, if you know about them, which one you use and why you like to use it. Like, so, you know, maybe everybody else that's still on the fence and they, you know, they don't they're still trying to understand uh let them know your experience whether it be uh in line or tapered what it is about that particular hook that you like that way other people can read your comments and maybe it can help them decide on which one they like better but that's the, you know that's the best way i can really explain it is the heads are very different as you can see in line got its name because the head is in line with the shaft the sh uh the uh tapered the head sticks out farther than the shaft. It's very much more shallow and it's not quite as sharp as the inline is very sharp and deep. So which one you choose, it, that is just up to you. There's not one that's better than the other. It's just which one is the best for you. Bye guys.